Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to quilt the background of uh, your pillow. I've uh, I want to align my the edge of my foot uh, to the seam uh, of uh, the uh, diamond shape, and that's simply because I want to continue keeping the same width as the quilting inside the uh, the six point star. So I'm ready. I'm going to uh, bring the needle down and back up so that I can grab my thread that was underneath. And so now I have both. I'm going to put my needle down. My foot is a little bit up so I can move it to the back. And then I'm going to stitch, tie a knot to, so I can get started. And now I am ready to uh, start quilting, which is what I'm going to do. And I'm going to be quilting all the way up to the uh, line here. So I want to make sure that once that needle hit, hits the white line that I have, that's going to be the sign that I need to turn around. So here I go. And now it's time to pivot and work my way down. So I do have a seam here, so it's easy to align my foot to make sure, but if not, I'll just have to uh, make sure that this alignment will cover the alignment of the, at the seam. So off we go, all the way down. And here, I have stitched in the ditch uh, in the, the, the three lines uh, of uh, the pillow. So I know that I need to stop at the, uh, at the seam that I see there where I stitched in the ditch. So once I hit that piece, that line, I can pivot. I think I can go one more. Okay, and then I can pivot and continue quilting until I reach the next point. So once you've done your first uh, quilting all around the star, uh, you simply realign on the next uh, on the the stitch that you've just done, and you repeat once more to get all of the quilting done. 